Hey, so we're here at the Ringling Brothers Barnum and Bailey Circus here at the Rose Garden. It's starting today, going through Sunday, which is the 20th of September. So we're going to wander around, see if maybe we can talk to a performer, talk to some people that are enjoying their time here. Just have a good time with the circus. So let's go. Hey everybody, we're here at the Ringling Brothers Barnum & Bailey Circus. We're here with Surly the Clown, who is one of the awesome acts here that's going to be going on all weekend. So we're going to ask a few questions and just figure out kind of what this is all about. So um, to start it off, just kind of see if we could get a background on how you got plugged in with the circus and what are some of the funnest things about your job here. Alright, good question. Um, I got my start in the circus back in 1994. I joined as a member of the floor crew. I've always wanted to be a performer and I very quickly made friends with a lot of the clowns on the show. They started teaching me cir circus skills and I took, I threw my hat in the ring, auditioned for Clown College, which was still open back in that, at that time. And after about seven auditions, I got accepted, went to Clown College, graduated, and I've been touring with the greatest show on earth. Good stuff, good stuff. So, so how long have you been, how long have you been a clown here? How long have you been Surly the Clown? I have been Surly the Clown now for one year. This is my first year at coming back as a clown. I was actually a clown on the road back in 1996. Um, I've done various jobs with this company since then, but I just recently signed a contract to tour this year as Surly the Clown, one of the heavies. Awesome, good stuff. Well, one thing about the Portland community is when you guys showed up here, we saw the train come up, we saw the elephants going across the road, yeah. so we wanted to figure out kind of what is it like to live on the road? What's it like to live in the train and go all over the country and deal with such awesome big animals like that? It's a very big privilege. I, I consider it a privilege. You know, not everybody gets a chance to do what we do. Not everybody gets a chance to even see our train up close and personal. Um, for me, it's a really big privilege. Like I said, I, I'm on the road 11 months out of the year. It's a very vigorous schedule. It's really hard. I'm away from home a lot, away from my family. But the rewards on the flip side, I get to put smiles on millions of faces per year. I'm in a different city every week, every other week. I get to see different cultures, different foods, meet new friends. I have friends all across the country. It's really, it's a really, really, really good time. This is definitely the greatest job on earth. Well, we're going to have a lot of first-time circus goers here this week. Awesome. And we're really looking forward to giving them a new piece of what the circus has to offer. But do you remember the first time you went to the circus? I did. And maybe some cool things about that time for you. My memories of the circus were the midget clowns. It's one of my really good memories. And also getting to see the legend himself, Gunther Gable Williams, before he before he passed away. Those are my two vivid, fond, fondest memories of the circus. Um, but as far as this show, what people can expect this year, this show is an awesome show. It's the first time in 139 years of the greatest show on earth being in, in existence that they have added magic as the basic premise to this year's show. This year, they're going to see an elephant disappear. They will see someone get cut in half. Um, they'll see a man get turned into a tiger. He comes out in a jar, the curtain goes down, it comes back up, and there's a white tiger inside the jar. Aside from that, we have acts from all around the world. We have a fantastic acrobatic troupe from China, the Chi Chi Har, that do an acrobatic um, number on a swinging platform. We have a double Russian swing act. We have an upside down act. We have a dual wheel act presented by the Fernandez brothers. We have an awesome, awesome show this year. And everybody can see it for about the price of a movie ticket. That price doesn't change no matter what show. Whenever we come to town, you're going to get a great show. Well, that's a good thing to hear, definitely, at this point, what's going on in the country right now. Um, one thing, with all these animals here, and you see elephants, and we've seen tigers, we're going to see zebras. So, are you a big pet guy? Do you have pets at home? What's your favorite animal? I do. I actually have a pet snake at home. Yeah, I have a uh, five and a half foot long uh, ball python. Her name's Delilah. But aside from that, my, my heart goes out to elephants. I am actually in love with the elephants here. I am, even though I'm a performer, I actually help out the animal crew with the animal walks from the train to the arena, so I'm part of that, that long-standing tradition of walking the elephants through the city every time we come and every time we leave. Awesome. 
some good stuff. Well, Barnum & Bailey, the name Barnum & Bailey has been around for a long time. And so obviously this kind of thing's been going on. There's always changes. But what do you think makes this circus so ageless and just so always exciting for such new generation? We've been here for 139 years. We, we strive to present some of the greatest acts that we get from around the world. This show in particular, we have acts from, that are representing 13 different countries. Acts from Bulgaria, from Russia, from China, uh, from Brazil. We have so many people from so many walks and so many different cultures of life that that's one of the long-standing traditions here. Being in the forefront of family entertainment, we strive to, to keep that expectation and that expectation high every year. We strive to do that. Awesome, good stuff. Well, fans are coming in. They're getting excited. We've loved being able to talk to you. Can you just say one thing that you're looking forward to, particular to Portland. What's one thing about Portland you're looking forward to this weekend? Celebrating my 20, my 21st hint, hint birthday. No, in all actuality, I am looking forward to the same thing in Portland that I look forward to in every different city, and that is actually having everyone come out, see the greatest show on earth, putting smiles on everyone's faces, helping you forget your problems and your outside life for the past, for the next two and a half hours. You belong to me, and it's my job to make sure that you have an awesome time here at the greatest show on earth. Awesome. Well, we want to thank Sir Lee the Clown so much. This has been an awesome opportunity for us to come down here, check out what's going on and we hope to see all of you down here. Thanks a lot. It's on. Eddie! Hey! Ready, watch. Eddie! Look over there! Ta da! Oh man! Awesome. See ya. <laughs> so, we are here at the elephant ring, and they are about to bring out Asia and Angelica, which are two of the elephants they're going to be performing tonight and all through the weekend. So, it's one of the coolest parts of the circus, so let's check it out and see what they're going to do. Well, thanks so much for hanging out with us today while we checked out the Barnum & Bailey Ringling Brothers Circus. It's going to be here all weekend. It's going to be tons of different stuff going on, and it definitely is the greatest show on earth. So come check out all the different performers they have here and just have a blast.